Welcome to Highline Excel 2013, class video number 23. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, Business 214, week 4, click on the link below the video. Hey, in this video, we have a lookup situation. We're looking up some sales rep, and we need to get the commission rate and then do something with that commission rate. However, not all of our sales rep are in our table, nor should they be. If they're not in the table, they need to be assigned a flat rate of 0 0.01. Let's try VLOOKUP and see what happens here. Our lookup value will be relative cell reference, comma, the table, highlight the table, first column, that'll try and get a match, second column has the value we want to return to the cell, F4 to lock it, comma, column index, 2 because the second column has the thing we want to get, comma, zero for exact match. This first column is not sorted. Close parentheses. Now VLOOKUP will be polite. I should probably put an equal sign. It'll return, control enter, double click and send it down, and NA, it says, hey, Chin is not in the table. Tim is not in the table. Those people get a flat rate, so this is the perfect use for I've already copied, and with the active cell in the highlighted range, I'm going to F2. This will be a perfect use for if an A. New in 2013. If it's an NA, it only checks for NA. We know about if error. That will check for all errors, but that's not what we want. We just want to check for the good old NA, not available. If that's the case, comma, then the value of NA, we can use this cell reference here, or we could hard code it in if we wanted. If it was not something's going to change, I'm going to F4, close parentheses. And now to repopulate this edited formula into the highlighted column, control enter. And just like that, we get all of our rates for the people who are in our table, and then the default rate for the ones who are not in the table. If NA and VLOOKUP. We'll see you next video.